total body. Let's begin our warm-up. So remove the weights. Out of the way. And see my feet. You can see my legs. We're going to warm up. And we're just going to march it out just high knees. And just some high knees. Getting our legs moving. Bending your knees. A little knee bend in there. Don't just lift the knee. Get a little bend in there. Get your own butt. Heels up. And the knee. Flexing in the knee, those hamstrings warmed up, those hips warmed up. And from here, ground jump jack. Light jump. Not a heavy jump jack, because this is still just a warm up. We're just up and down. Just up and down. I can take my arms up here. That's a big jam. A little one. Yes. So we're getting our heart rate up, getting ourselves ready. We'll stop their legs wide. From here, we're going to have a slight knee bend. Twist and reach. Missing our waist, we're incorporating a little bit of legs. Just a little bit. Moving all the way over. High balance because our stance is wide. We're going to reach over and over. Reaching over. This is more of our side bend than a twist. Side bend. Now from here, front to your shoulders. Sitting in front, opening, closing, wide. Warming up our shoulders. Ready for the arm aspects of total body. Gonna warm up the whole body. We gotta get the whole body ready to go. And we're gonna rotate back. Our back stroke. Pinkies back. Stretch out the chest. Arms. Reaching. Bring your elbows in, try to take your hands, and we're going to do our circles for our elbows. Elbow circles. We've got our shoulder circles, we've made the circle a little smaller. We're circling at the elbow. Opening, closing, bending the elbow. And the other way. Crossing the front. Have our hands. We're going to use our hands to do the elbows. We use our shoulders, and we're making our circles. Moving around. Any circles with our wrists. Close the hands and fingers. Get the fingers ready. And we're going to try and close each section of the fingers until we make a fist. Lastly, we're putting our hands down. Just hang out here. And our craft. And our neck. And our neck. Look up. We're going to look over to one side. We'll look to the other side and we bring chin to chest and make our circles one, two, 
three. We're back at the chin to chest pumaka. On the other side. On the other side. Chin to chest. Make ourselves look like that. Up. First side. Second side. Chin to chest. Two. Three. Up. Second side. First side. One, two, three. Bringing it in. We're going to start from the toes. So, all we're going to do is simple test. I want you to flex your glutes. Toes open up. Squeeze my glutes and my feet open. And I'm going to bring my toes together. Come up. Off my glutes. Let me turn to the side. We're going to squeeze the glutes and open our feet. And bring them back together. And come up. Off our heels and back down. Squeeze together. Squeeze together. Four. Squeeze together. Six. Squeeze together. Seven. Face here. Squeeze together. Eight. Squeeze it. Squeeze them tight. Those five. Eight. Squeeze together. Up. Nine. Squeeze together. Up. Now we'll spread our feet. Four. Best way to find that distance, we're going to squeeze it, turn our toes out, and make our toes straight. Now we're about to hit or shoulder width distance or somewhere in between. Our heels are planted. We're going to keep our back straight. The main thing is keep your heels planted as we do whatever you want. So from here, hands at the hips, hands out in front. Bend your knees as far as you can go, and then squeeze the glutes. It's all about the glute squeeze. Go, squeeze it tight, release it, sit down as low as you can. Right now, there's a 90 degree bend. If you sit a little lower, here, sit, three, release. Squeeze the glutes. Four. Release. Squeeze the glutes. Five. Release. Squeeze the glutes. Six. Release. Squeeze. Seven. Release. Squeeze. Eight. Release the glutes all the way up. Squeeze them all the way up. Nine. Release. Squeeze. And exhale. Now we're going to open up. And then make them straight again. Now we're outside our shoulder width. This is our wide stance. And from here, we're going to sit on one side at a time. Squeeze the glutes again. I'm going to bend as far as I can go. I'm going to turn to the side so you can see me. Let it sit. You don't have to go super low. It's not super necessary. Watch the concentrate of the muscle that we're focusing on and make it work. Over here, I'm going to sit down to one side. I feel the stretch of my glute. I'm going to push from my glute to come up, driving my heel into the floor. That's one. On the other side, driving up, squeezing at the top, both glutes. Two, release, squeeze. Three, release, double squeeze. Four, release, squeeze. Five, release, squeeze. Six, release. Squeeze. Seven. Release. And squeeze. Eight. Release. Squeeze. Nine. Release. And squeeze. Ten. Now, let's try these exercises with some of The main thing I want you to think about when doing these squatting maneuvers is to contract your glutes, your booty muscles when you're at the top of the exercise and through the movement. 
of the exercise. As you release them, they go down. Let me grab the dumbbells. Squeeze. Open my toes. I'm going to bring my toes together. And I'm going to come up off my heels. One. Squeeze. Together. Up. Two. Together. Up. Three. Squeeze. Together. Up. Four. Squeeze. Together. Up. Five. Squeeze. Together. Up. Six. Squeeze. Together. Up. Seven. Squeeze. Together. Up. Eight. Squeeze. Together. Up. Nine, squeeze it tight, together, up, and squeeze, bring our toes, the bigger feet through. Parallel there, about hip, about shoulder width distance. And I sit down, releasing my glutes. Actually, you know what? I want you to squeeze while we're here at the top, so you can practice releasing it down. And release the glutes down, as long as you can comfortably go. Squeeze up. One. Release. Squeeze. Two. Release. Squeeze. Three. Turn it to the Release. Three. Four. Release. Five. Release. Squeeze. Six. Release. Eight, release, and squeeze. Nine, release, and squeeze. Go back. Now we're here. We're opening up again. Open those toes up and make the feet straight. We're outside of shoulder width. Let's switch to one dumbbell. From one weight, just gonna hold it in the middle. As I sit to one side. Squeeze in the middle. It's a double squeeze. Feel both loose. Both cheeks left and right. Squeezing tight. So let's go to that first side again. Release. Squeeze. One. Release. Squeeze. Two. Release. Squeeze. Three. Release. Squeeze. Four. Release. Squeeze. Five. Release. Squeeze. Six. Release. Squeeze, seven, release, squeeze, eight, release, squeeze, nine, release, squeeze, down, be more left. Stop squeezing, shake it loose, shake it loose. The main, the big important factor we want to think about is when we're doing these exercises, we're thinking, mind, in the muscle for our squat series, for that movement, a lot of that action is in our hips. So we're thinking about our glutes. Okay. We're thinking about our glutes when working our legs. Now, let's bring it up. Okay. We're gonna bypass the core, we're gonna use the mat for the core. We're going to the core for the core. We're here in upper body. What we don't want you to work on now. Uh, make tight this. Keep the elbows planted to the side and squeeze the biceps. The elbow point is still down. I'm not going to scoop under. I'm going to hold it here. Bring it down. Squeeze it up. Bring it down and up. When I go down, I flex my triceps, back of the arm, and then squeeze up. Bring it down. Let's do five more together. If you haven't been doing it with me, let's do ten. Squeeze up, bring it down. Squeeze up, down, squeeze, down, squeeze, down, squeeze, down. That's our five. Squeeze, and then turn it over. Here's our overhead press. This points that way. I'm going to go up. Once I'm up, elbows down, right? 
When the elbow's down and the fist is up, go straight up to the ceiling. Right overhead, bring my elbows to the floor. Go straight up to the ceiling, bring the elbows to the floor. We'll call that two. Right up to the ceiling, bring my elbows down. Three, ceiling, elbows down. Four, ceiling, elbows down. Five, ceiling, elbows down. Six, ceiling, elbows down. Seven, ceiling, elbows down. Eight, ceiling, elbows down. Nine, ceiling, elbows down. Now, left Bring it flat. Face the floor, we're gonna bring the elbows up. Gonna make our elbows clap together. Squeeze them, hold them together, and then bring it down. Ceiling, elbows together, down two. Will the elbows touch? No, but we're gonna try it. We're gonna bring it up. Will we touch the ceiling? Probably not, but we'll squeeze it together and down. Three, squeeze it up, touch, hold. Up, together, five. Squeeze it up, touch it together. Six, up, together. Seven, bring it up, together. Up, together. Nine. Elbows to the ceiling, bring them together. Together. All right. So that was a, a walk through of the movements without our resistance. Now let's grab our resistance. We're going to start with our curls. So we got our nice curling weight. And if you don't have a weight, you're gonna do the exercise the same way we just did it without, with high concentration. You're gonna flex and control the muscle. The action will be in the muscle. So I'm gonna turn my hands out. I wanna make sure my arm is pointed straight down. My mid arm is my elbow pointing down. And then I'm gonna squeeze up. Elbow's not gonna change. And I'm gonna flex down. Flex that bicep. Up, down, two, up, down, three, up, down. Four, up, down. Five, up, down. Six, up, down. Seven, up, down. Eight, up, down. Nine, up, and down. Ten. So we can bring it up. And our elbows facing the floor. Elbows facing the floor. Fists to the sky. We're going to squeeze up. Wait to my touch. You got dumbbells, they're gonna touch. Bring the elbows down to the floor and up. Down, two. Up, down, three. Up, down, four. Up, down, five. Up, down, six. Up, down, seven. Up, down, eight. Up and down. Nine. Up and down. Now we're going to get flat. Bring our elbows up to the ceiling. Squeeze those elbows together. Bring it all the way down. Nice and easy. Nice and slow. To the ceiling. Squeeze them together. And down two. Up together. Down three, up, elbows together, down four, up, elbows together, down five, up, elbows together, down six, up, elbows together, down seven, up, elbows together, down eight, up, elbows together, down nine, up, elbows together, down Weights down. So when we're moving our weights, when we're thinking about our strength, we want to activate and squeeze and flex the muscle. It's the main focus, it allows us to work out when we have equipment or when we don't. Because the mind is in the muscle, we're getting the skeleton to move properly, we're getting the right muscles to activate for the right action. Let's hit to the mat, 
place it is. Now with abs, we're not going to really use any resistance. Get down to the bottom. Finish with abs and we're going to relax. It's a relaxation period. I like to prop myself up. Put my hands just behind my hips. Bring my elbows to the floor. Bring my chest up. To start. And what we do is I'll flex my abs. And I'm going to bring my knees to my chest. So when my chest is up, I'm going to flex and bring my knees towards my chest. And then I'm going to let them out and bring them back to the floor. All right, let's give that a go. Loosens up. Hold the squeeze. Release. One. Squeeze up. Two, squeeze up, release. Three, squeeze up, release. Four, squeeze up, release. Five, squeeze, hold it. Six, bring it up, hold it. Seven, bring it up, hold it. Eight. Bring it up. Hold it. Now nine. Squeeze it up. And hold that muscle tight. Bring it out. Ten. Let me hang your legs up straight. Lay flat. All the way down to the floor. We're getting more and more relaxed as we bring it down. But still are working. Reaching our arms up. We're going to squeeze. We can start with our hands over here. By ourselves. The main thing is we're using our abs to sit ourselves up. So, we can squeeze up. There's our crunch. We can squeeze a little more. And we start to come up. And now we're sitting all the way up. If we only have that first crunch, that's fine. That's where our resistance level is. And we're going to release it back in. We squeeze in sections. Crunch a little more. Get down nice and easy. Two. Sweet. All the way up. Down easy. Three. Sweet. All the way up. Down easy. Four. Sweet. Down easy. Five. Sweet. Down easy. Six. Sweet. Bring it down. Seven. Squeeze. Down to easy. Eight. Squeeze. Down to easy. Nine. Squeeze. Down to easy. Ten. From here, let's flip over. Stretch out. Lay flat on your bellies. Flex on feet. Hands under our armpits. We're going to breathe in. Stretching the arms out. Looking up. And stretch the abs. Yeah. Upper dog. I hope so. Really reach the chin to the sky. Up. Arms are straight. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. We're going to inhale, lifting ourselves up. Bring our knees under our hips, hands under our shoulders. As we inhale, reaching our hearts to our hands. And our heads to the sky, looking up, breathe in, breathe out, chest to ch chin to chest, round the back, breathe in, and out, breathe in, and out, breathe in, and 
Um, we sit back onto our heels, reaching with our hands. Breathe. We're going to roll up. Out of our child's pose, and I'm going to step forward with my. This is my left leg. Start with any leg you like. I'm going to sit up, and I'm going to bring my hip to my foot. My hips forward. So three bits. Breathe in. Back up. Breathe in. Take my hips forward. Alright. One more time. Forward. We're going to switch our legs. Your hip towards our heel, squeezing the hips, squeezing the glute muscles. Forward, reaching. Bring that hip close to the heel. Hip to heel. From here, put the hand on the mat as I step forward. My feet are about hip distance apart. I'm just going to reach down to the desk. Down with our toes, let our head fall. And then from here, reach the heart to the toes and lift the head up. Place your hands on your knees in front. Looking out, back and straight. I'm shaking my chest. I'm to put my toes in the heart. You may not get there. But you feel the stretch in your hamstrings. And release, hands and toes head down, breathe in, breathe your heart to your toes, flat. Exhale, reach for the floor, inhale, flat. Exhale to the floor, hang out here, hanging on your, hang loose on your head, hang loose. And as we breathe in, we're gonna roll up slowly. One vertebrae at a time, breathe in. Oh, yeah. Reaching up overhead, breathe in. Push the hips forward, standing back then. Breathe in, reach up. Exhale, touch the toes. Inhale, roll up. Reach up. Hips forward, back bend. Inhale. And roll up a little bit of time. Breathe in. Get forward. Back in. Now reach up. Exhale. Bring your arms down by your side. Now we're standing here in what we call in yoga the mountain pose. Hands on the belly. I'm just going to breathe. Yoga is not just flexibility, it builds strength in the body, it brings bills down. In, just relaxing breath, deep into the belly. Thank you for coming. My total body strength. We hope you've had a good time. If you like the class, if you enjoy what we do, please hit the like button. Thank you. If you have any comments, Leave a comment. You've clearly already subscribed, so tell everybody about it. Thank you for coming. Thank you, Esther. Thank you, Renee. I'll see everybody next time. Have a great rest of your day. Till next time, I'll be seeing you.